All right, y'all, we are back with another video and here we go again. Now, Donald Trump's lawyer, Alina Haber, says she is going to sue E. Jean Carroll. You know what I'm saying? And this right here just had got out of hand very, very fast. Because if y'all remember that E. Jean Carroll, she went on that show she's talking about she's going to, uh, like, I think she went on where? Was that MSNBC? Talking to Rachel Maddow, talking about she going to uh, buy her some. She can't wait to get her money. She going to go shopping. She going to go buy everybody some. You know, just bragging. And it just don't make no sense. And then she says some creepy stuff to this guy that uh, they going to get ready and show in this video about saying that getting R word is sexy. It's like you can tell this woman's story was a complete lie from the get go. And that's the reason why a lot of us can just sit back and say, this woman right here is lying. Her story don't make sense. She quoting movies from, from like quoting stuff from law and order. You know what I'm saying? And that's why a lot of us didn't believe this woman. And she had got that crooked judge, Judge Kaplan, who went into her favor and tried to award her this money. But Elena Hopper said that E. Jean Kara is not getting a dime of that money and said that she is going to sue her. So we definitely finna go ahead and dive straight into it. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Shout out to everybody showing so much support. Everybody been leaving positive comments in the comment section. Also want to thank everybody who clicked on the video for the very first time. And like I said, please hit that like button so more people can see this video. And make sure you watch to the end so you don't miss out because Alina Hobble was not playing. All right. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into it, y'all. Let's go. And this is what you were talking about, by the way. This kills me. That this here. kills me. This makes. I could even, not bring this in front of the jury. Brother, would not let me bring. Just look at just look at her hair before it even plays. That's a crazy person hair. By the She's way, crazy. Even Anderson Cooper. <laughs> yeah. Couldn't <clears throat> believe what she just said. Yeah. Ahead, Rob. I don't feel like a victim. I was not thrown on the ground and ravished. Which the word carries so many connotations. This was not. This was not. For, it just it it hurt. It just what it just mm -hmm. you know. Well, I think most people think as a I mean it is a violent assault. It is not. I a think most people think of being sexy. What? <laughs> no, Let's watch him cut. Think of the fantasies. Mm. We're going to take a quick break. I don't want to be at work today. By the way, that was my entire. Defense. And they wouldn't let you play it. I was not allowed to play By it. By the way, this is my favorite part. Oh, Look what it. she says to him. Go ahead, Rob. Watch Just take a quick break. We're watch you, watch what she we'll says. Talk more on the other fascinating. Side. You're fascinating to talk to. <laughs> she said that to me. Jesus. She said oh that to me. She said she was talking to me. She how she Alina, how, how much of the 83 million is she going to see? <laughs> Zero. Zero. And then I'm going to sue for attorney's fees. Woo! Going to sue. Oh, I can't wait for that. Oh, yeah. So <laughs> she can't go shopping? No, no, no. You mean she can't take she Rachel can't out buy, shopping? She can't buy her France? Yeah. Oh, wow. I watched that. I said, I said, Reed Hoffman, I hope you're watching. DNC, I hope you're watching. This is the person. This you is picked. the person you picked. Yeah. <laughs> she, look at, I couldn't talk about her cat's name. I couldn't talk about that. Yeah, this. This. Oh, look at these people. Bro. You've look. talked about using some of Trump's money that you're about to get um, to help shore up women's rights. Do you know what that might be? What that might look like? Yes, or, Rachel. Oh my God. Yes. Tell me. <laughs> I had such, such great ideas for all the good I'm going to do with this money. Psycho. First thing, Rachel, you and I Her are going to go shopping. Quick. We're going to get completely <laughs> new wardrobes, new shoes. That's really good. Motorcycle for Crowley, new fishing rod for Robbie. Uh -huh, Rachel, what are you Yeah, the lawyers are panicking, by the way. Watch. Yeah. Rachel. Yeah. Oh, my God. No, and then... And <laughs> That do not make no sense at all. This is ridiculous. What person, if they saying that something like that happened to them, that they'll be sitting there bragging about what they're going to buy with the money and saying you're going to buy this woman this, buy this person this. And then Disturbing. if you find the video of her house, she, there's a video of her. She's got red hair. 90 she, cats? That was another cats? one. No, but the cat's name. Oh, you couldn't say the cat. What's the cat's name? Is this the one? Of course you know the cat's name. Mouse Welcome House. Welcome to the mouse. Oh, my That's God. That's not her. That's her. That's I call it the Mouse House because some very distinguished uh, mice live here. 
Uh, Kahneman lives in the kitchen. Tversky lives in the bedroom. This is my shed. Oh my and God! On that this is side, a joke. Uh, oh, I tried to get this books. in. They wouldn't let me. Dude, that wasn't true that detective. That's where the psych serial killer up. lived. On the door are the list of my dogs. Is this a Marky, joke? No. Dude, for this is not. Tuna this is the same lady. Spunky, yeah, this is her. Heidi, Tits, <laughs> this is her. Tits, and Hepburn. The streams and the rivers were dry. And I, it so horrified me that oh I came out and started painting the rocks blue to indicate that there was once a river here. And then after I oh got done painting the rocks, I just sort of walked over here and then did that tree and then did that tree and then I did this tree. And then pretty soon I'd done this whole fourth. Although well, she's voting Democrat 100. Like that's the Democrat voter base is that By person By the way, Patrick, right let, me, oh. let me flip this. And <laughs> Alina, that's weird. I'd, I'd, I'd love you on this. Let's say... Can we, can we do a, like a quick case study? Yeah. Okay. You are a criminal defense attorney. Oh. Alina takes a gun and is shooting randomly and wounds, not kills, one of her neighbors. The DA wants to put her away for attempted murder. How would you defend her? You would use every clip and say, my poor client is not mentally capable of standing trial. There's so many of those clips that would say I'm not mentally <laughs> capable. <laughs> no, yeah. As her attorney, what would you do with all this? Well, I mean, literally. That's what I tried to do. I was not allowed. Imagine if you're a jury and you just see those two videos. You Are you awarding anybody $83 million? No. Okay. I wasn't allowed. So then you got these people on CNN and MSDNC going, Hub is a terrible lawyer. <laughs> I couldn't bring it in because the judge wouldn't let me. So, yeah, I had a jury, but the judge, before the jury came in, said, oh, Haba, you're not bringing that. You're not saying that she has a, uh, uh, what is it, a dog named Vag Yeah. Cat named Vag Vag Tea Fireball. Let's get yes. it right. Vag Vag Tea Fireball. Fireball. Is the cat's name. Is wow. the cat's name. I couldn't. That sounds but like no, trouble. But if you're saying somebody defamed you, if you're saying somebody hurt you, the most terrible, horrific crime, and my case was just defamation. So you're telling me that I can't litigate through the appellate division the first case. That is crazy. Now I have to go on trial for the second case, even though the first case hasn't been determined by the appellate division. Hasn't been overseen, right? So now I got to go on a trial with this verdict that's insane already. And then I got to go in and, and the judge says, oh, no, he defamed her. And that's why people think she's crazy because of what President Trump said. And I can't play those videos of her mm -hmm. saying. Some people would say sexy, whatever she said, on Anderson Cooper and showing Anderson Cooper cutting immediately, probably talking to her during Completely the Completely flummoxed. He's, he's pretty pretty sure he like the lawyer from my cousin Vinny. The, uh, j j j j he, he turned no. into that guy. No, and the point I'm trying to make for people listening <laughs> is that if you had a conservative district attorney... Um, we have to take a break. We have to take a quick break because yeah. our sponsors wanted us to give a quick mm -hmm. shout-out to... Uh, uh, what's the, the, but that right there is just crazy. But y'all heard what Alina said, that that judge wouldn't allow her to show these type of clips. This woman has a cat named, y'all heard what she said, I'm not going to say it, YouTube is just so strict. But this is just crazy. How can anyone listen to this woman say that Donald Trump did something to this woman? Look how, look how she act. You're very fascinating to talk to. I think getting all worded is sexy. Just, just, just put all of that stuff in the air, along with, you bragging about getting $83 million knowing this man never touched you. Just lying. Because that's, that's why a lot of us were just pissed off about this because her story just don't add up. Look how crazy this woman Look what she named her animals. She out there paint trees. She's saying getting our word is sexy. I mean, like, come on. Don't, who, have y'all ever heard somebody that, that, that said they got our word and then bragging about the money they finna get and offering on live TV saying, I'm going a, I'm to a buy Rachel Maid out of this. What do you want? What do you want? I can't wait to get Trump's money. Like, come on. That's a red flag. This judge was crooked. How we know that this judge ain't trying to get part of that $83 million that Easy and Kara think she going to get? I mean, how we don't know that? How we know that Judge Kaplan ain't in on this and he trying to get some of that money, the reason why he pushed it up so high, because he trying to get some of that money. These people are just crooked.
That's why I constantly call this crap out. Of course, it be some people that comes to the channel, they get mad. Oh, you wrong. You trying to take up for Trump. You like, no, this story just don't add up. It ain't the point about trying to take up for Trump. Her story don't add up. This woman was getting quotables from law and order. She, this woman is coloring trees. She got a, a, a cat name. I'm not going to say it. Like, and you just put all that stuff together. This woman just ain't got it all. And that's the reason why I call this crap out. That's the reason why I said before, I don't be holding back. I call the crap out. Wounded them. That's attempted murder. The liberals would come back the other way and say, oh, no, 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 no. You should let her walk. She was just misunderstood or she's she's mentally not quite all there. And they would use every bit of this mm -hmm. to let the perp walk. Mm -hmm. you, you know, you know, the saddest thing about this whole thing is this is all the stuff that they're doing, obviously, on purpose, obviously. It's called cheating, not election interference. These are all the talking points that whoever's going to run against Trump is going to use. Even though it's all BS, they're going to be like January 6th insurrection, all the felonies, the bloodbath. You know, the bloodbath thing is going to come back, even though we all know it was all BS. And then these are all talking points that whoever's going to debate way, is going to use. He was not found guilty. That's what I'm saying. Insurrection for no, none of them. You know, I mean, it's crazy. It's crazy. And and but more crazy to me, more than any of the PR, any of the TV stuff, any of the politics, more crazy for me. This shouldn't be happening in courts. Yeah, that's it's the just, sad part. This is court. And just let everybody know if you hear something in my background, it's because somebody outside my house mowing their grass and stuff or something like that. So if you hear a little sound, somebody's out there mowing their grass. But just to let y'all know, E. Jean Carroll, if y'all really pay attention, this woman really finally admitted that she lied on Trump. She did, That's what she really did. If you read in between the lines, she really finally admitted that she lied on Trump. Because, like, come on, you know this man didn't touch you. You don't rem you talking about you don't remember nothing. That's why I said I never know somebody that can go to court, say they don't remember anything and walk out and won eighty three million dollars. That judge knew that woman was lying. That's why he didn't want Alina playing any of them video clips. The video clips that we just seen, she couldn't play none of that in court because he that, that judge knew that woman was lying. He knew that. And then she got on TV and finally admitted that she lied on Trump. And y'all heard earlier in the video that Elena Hobbs said she's going to sue her. It's coming. We're not talking about TV land. This is in court. I couldn't play that. See? So, so long story short, there's nothing else crazy that's going on that they can come after him for no. money except for criminal cases that we have. Right. Number two, uh, he's going to put up the 175 million has to be in an account like the entire 175 or 10% of the 175. 10% on top of the one. So it's 175. So 17. So 192, whatever, yeah. 195. Yeah. Exactly. But like an okay. escrow. In a bond. Wow. They, put, they bond it. So the you, whole you 196. It. The like whole amount. So. <sighs> Mm -hmm. That's okay. crazy. That's a lot of cash, guys. That's a lot of money. Yeah. That's a, and that's, by the way, the so just so you guys understand, when they asked for the 500, let's call it, but it really was more like six, seven with the 10% on top, plus the interest, plus whatever. Um, we went to Chubb, the best, course. brightest uh, insurance carry. You know, they're great. And we say, hey, um, we need this. But they don't do it. There's only seven. The United States Treasury has strict regulations on who can give that large of a bond. OK, there are only, I think, seven or so. Uh, bond companies that are actually qualified to do it. So it's not like, oh, you can just go to the open market and say, who's going to help Trump? It's not about that. You can't just put cash. You have to get a bond. You have to put it up. And they only take cash or cash equivalents. Mar so you can't have an asset and put a lien on Mar-a-Lago. They won't allow that. So people don't realize in this whole narrative, Trump's broke, Trump's begging for money. Mm, no, not even close. If you look at the regulations in our country, the Treasury regulations, it takes the entire globe of bond people, it cuts it down to seven, then it cuts it even smaller and says, okay, now you have your seven, but by the way, you actually have to have cash or a cash equivalent. You have to have stocks, you have to have cash, you have to, tell me what smart billionaire has a billion dollars sitting in cash in a bank. <clears throat> Not You're one. stupid, you wouldn't be a billionaire. You would not be a billionaire. And by right. the way, President Trump has so much cash, more cash than probably anybody I know. But you are telling me that that's a no. And then they say the whole narrative. 
He's. I thought he was a billionaire. Yeah, I mean, go. it's just but it, garbage. But it's, it's going to Yeah, the, it's just people that's on the left that don't like Donald Trump be saying that dumb stuff. And we all knew the man got the money. The problem is he just didn't have the money to give to corrupt Letitia James them. You know what I'm saying? He, don't, he didn't have the money for them because they're crooked. They're just trying to take his money because the money Donald Trump said he had, he even said this on True Social. He said the money that he had is for his campaign, that he's putting in his campaign, and they're trying to take it. They're trying to take all his money so he, so he wouldn't have any money to continue in the campaign. I told you, as it get closer and closer to an election, they are trying their best to, to get Donald Trump. They are trying. But like I've said before, only thing Letitia James, Fannie Willis, all these people going after Donald Trump, the only thing they doing is helping him out in the polls. Because the more you attack him, the more you his numbers just raise up in the poll. So keep on attacking. Keep doing it. Because you ain't doing nothing but helping him out. And it all started with Fannie Willis. When he took that mug shot, it went skyrocketing from there. They're going to, and by the way, the the whole Truth Social, Tom, where's the stock at He's today? Killing it. He's uh, killing it. He's killing it. Truth Social. It's, it's, it's 66. Everybody said it was going to pop and drop. Nope. It's staying stable and it's staying around I 7 mean, billion. And his, his take is staying right around, not take, his ownership of a company he has built once again. Good. Trump, the entrepreneur, built another company. Yep. 62 to 66 has been the trading range. 63 right now. Look at the market. No, no. That's not right, Rob. You're, what company oh, but, are you on? That's not it. That's, no, no, no. That's trans. You that gotta go to DJ. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. No, he went to DJ. It's not thirty-six billion. Maybe. Go DJ. Well, there's Dow Jones Transportations. You went the DJT it's stock. DJT there you go. There we go. Yo, sixty-six. High, that's what yeah. I said. Yep. And today we're at a mark cap of nine point four seven Up billion. Sixty percent of that yep. is sitting yep. on four billion dollars. Good for him. For anything he can't touches touch for six months. Anything well, he touches turns to gold. I swear. Well, He's, he really is incredibly bright. That's but, why. But, Alina is right about that. Anything he touches, think about it. Now he's said in the Bibles, doing good. The sneakers sold out. Now he got this with true social. See, that's why they mad, because everything Donald Trump do, he succeeds in. Facts. Anything he do, he succeeds in. You think Joe Biden can sell some sneakers? Wouldn't nobody buy them. You think Joe Biden can sell Bibles? Wouldn't nobody buy it. Joe Biden couldn't do anything. Nothing. Why? They can't stand him. They because hate him. he's bright. Mm -hmm. He's smart. And if you try and censor him on Twitter, he'll just create another company right. and kill it. And he's, he's, by the way, I, I don't think people give him enough credit for what a great DJ he is. There you go. Oh, uh, my God. DJ DJT yeah. is he, the best. He, he is, is uh, amazing. Best he, he needs to put that in his resume and go up against like <laughs> David Solomon and say who's a better <laughs> DJ. And he needs I, to be DJing. But OK. I can, can no we? longer. All right, y'all. There we go right there. There we go. As y'all can see in the video, uh, Elena kind of pretty much let us know that she's going to sue E. Jean Carroll. She said it's coming. It said that E. Jean Carroll is not getting a dime of Donald Trump's money, especially after you get on that show. And that's the reason why I said in the beginning that she finally admitted that she lied on Donald Trump because I don't know nobody who gets on that show and don't remember anything. I don't remember because it never happened. That's why you don't remember. And then you're bragging about uh, what you gonna do with his money? You telling for Rachel made out him that you gonna buy him some? You out there coloring trees? It's like, uh, who would listen to this woman? It's just ridiculous. But like I said, y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think about it. Thank you all for watching, and I catch y'all in the next one.